Hello, good evening. Good evening. Hi, people. How have you been, guys? How's everything? That's just... All right. So that's a, like a good ringtone. <laughs> All right, guys. Welcome back to another video conference. Right. So we are going to continue with part of, uh, you know, like um, the topic that we were discussing in the previous class. I hope you guys have had a good day yesterday, right? You, I hope you had, uh, you know, like rested well since you didn't go to work. So I guess you got a good day yesterday, right? Uh, so tonight, as I said, we are going to continue with the top uh, we were just discussing the last class. But before starting with that, I would like to start with a top or feedback from what we were doing the last class, all right? So, guys, what would you remember from last class? What was the topic that we were discussing? And what was the most relevant that you guys remember? Uh, people. What do we remember from the last class, guys? Description. Um, uh -huh. a personal description, for example, the appearance, the hair, um, age. Okay. All right. Hi. Okay. Very good. Okay. Perfect. Thank you, Roberto. That was part of what we were just working on the last class. What do you guys? remember besides what Roberto said what were we doing the last class at the end of the class I remember you told us that you you were gonna start with the people that don't get don't give you the their description Ah, all right. With the people that we, uh, they, they didn't participate, right? With they the, the didn't participate. Yeah. No. Okay, very good, very good. So we're going to start with that, by the way. Uh, I'm not pretty sure about the people because I see very few of your classmates connected, but we're going to check on who were not participating in the last class, right? So, and as Rafael said, uh, that was correct, right? So we were discussing, uh, you know, like appearances, right? The last class. So we were just uh, discussing a couple of adjectives, all right? That we can easily describe a person by the age, height, the hair, right? And the look here, right? So, Tonight, so we're going to continue with that, but tonight what we are going to be focusing on, it's in how to create questions, okay, related to physical appearances or, or how to describe mostly, right, people. So that's what we guys are going to be focusing on. So just give me one second, Christian says, teacher is studying the mentors. Okay, Christian, thank you for letting me know that. All right, so but before starting with that, guys, I am going to start with the attendance list. I guess we have uh, that are more connected, so uh, we're going to start with the attendance list. And right after that, we are going to focus on what we have for tonight. So let me see. Alfredo Enrique. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Ana Maria. Present teacher. Okay, great. Brenda Angelica. 
Brenda. Okay, she's not here. Karen Beatriz. All right, so Karen is not here. Okay, no, she's, she's not connected yet. Selena Janet. Present. Okay, perfect. Clara Marina. Present teacher. Okay, excellent. Cristian Eduardo. All right, Cristian is on the way home, by the camino. David Alberto. Present. Okay, very good. David Armando. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Uh, Denis Gerardo. Okay, Denis. Diego Rodolfo. Is Diego here? Okay, not yet. Uh, Erika Michel. Present teacher. Okay, very good. All right, so just give me a second, guys. This is just getting locked in. Uh, Fatima Laura. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Gabriela Margarita. Gabriela, Gabriela. Guillermo says, I am working. Huh? I am working as a teacher. I mean, you, you say that you're working, Guillermo, o que está trabajando como profesor. Porque literal me ha dicho que está trabajando como profesor. Mm -hmm. Supongo que uh, you're, you're working. That's what you're telling me. Okay. Thank you for letting me know that. Guillermo Arraizo is it Gabriela. Is Gabriela. All right, so just not here. Griselda Jamilet, uh, I think Griselda is the one that told me that she's, ah, okay, yeah, yeah. okay. Okay, so let's continue, Guillermo, all right, Guillermo said that he's, that he's working, Jaime Vladimir. Present teacher. Okay, excellent, Jenny Marisol. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Jose Roberto. Presente. All right, very good. Joselina Abigail. Present. All right. Jocelyn, I ha I had you before in a in a in a group. Ya la he tenido antes a usted, Jocelyn. No. Primera vez que estoy con usted. Es que, es que, qué extraño. Ahí hay, es que en una lista me apareció alguien con su mismo nombre. Así, Jocelyn. Es que That's no. weird. I thought it was you, man. Ah. Ok. Ok. Uh, Rafael Ernesto. Present. Ok, very good. Roberto Antonio. Eh, present. Ok. Uh, Sonia Guadalupe. Present. Ok, great. Walter Manuel. Is Walter here? Walter, Walter. No, right, so he's not here yet. Janira Isabel. Ok. You are a listener, okay, and uh, Judy Magdalena. Present, teacher. Okay, perfect. Teacher, um, present. Ah, you're there, Walter. Okay, Walter, thank you. Let me see, estará de viente. Okay, Isabel. Ah, Brenda is here. So just let me add you here. 
Vamos, pues, prenda, prenda, prenda. Oh. Here. Okay, great, guys. As I said, we're going to start with uh, the people who didn't finish the description of the last class. Quiero que sean honestos, people. ¿Quiénes no participaron en la clase pasada? With the description. Mejor apagaron las cámaras, ¿verdad? <laughs> ah, come on, people. Ah, okay, Roberto Guzmán, you were one of those, right? You haven't uh, participated on that. Okay, can you, can you, mister, describe, right, yourself as your classmates did it? Okay, uh, my description. I have the high brown okay. and a mustache and beard. Okay. Um, I'm middle age and mm -hmm. I'm medium height. Ah, medium height. Um, medium uh, height. And also I use, I wear high glasses. Ah, okay, okay, very good. Thank you, Roberto. Good, well done. All right, perfect. Who else besides Roberto? ¿Quién más aparte de Roberto? Who's missing? Yo, teacher. Okay, perfect, Judy. All right. So let's start. Um, I had curly brown hair. hair. Okay. I had age brown. I am not I am not good looking. I am middle age. I am short. All right, so you're short. Okay. What's your height, Yuri? 150, 160? 158. 158? Oh, okay, okay. So that's the average. Okay, very good. Thank you, Judy. <laughs> okay, great. All right, guys, who else is missing? King Mas Falta. Jenny, did you participate? No, teacher. Ah, okay, good. Let's go. <laughs> okay, I have long brown brown hair. Hair, hair. And hair, okay. And I have brown eyes. I am middle, 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 middle age. Middle I age. Pretty. I am pretty and I am medium height. Of medium height. Height. Okay, okay, very good. Thank you, Jenny. All right, good. All right, guys, who else was missing? Ana Maria, did you participate? No ha venido. No ha venido. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's just start. <laughs> I have black eyes and eyes. short curly hair. I <laughs> uh -huh. mm. and short curly hair. Okay. I am middle age. Middle age. I am, uh -huh. I am of medium age and good looking. Ah, uh, okay. Good looking. All right. Very good. So you are like what, uh, 150, 160, kind of like that? 151. 151, really? Okay, all right, there you go. Thank you, Ana Maria. Okay, <laughs> so who else is missing, guys? Ambos David participaron en la clase pasada? Because I just remember one. No, teacher, you know. Ah, okay, yeah, man, all right? So, David Armando is the one that participated. Okay, all right, David Alberto, let's start. Okay. I have brown eyes and a short black hair. All right. I am middle age and I am medium height. Okay. There you go. And that's it. Okay, great. Thank you, uh, Mr. Let me see who else is missing, guys. Creo que los que faltan, unos no se han conectado y los demás están vivientes. Right, Dennis? You're one of those, Dennis. Okay. But uh, since we need guys to...
continue with the, the development of the topics that we got in there. So we're gonna stop in there with that. And I am going to share with you guys what we are going to do right now. So like right now, what we guys are going to be working on, it's going to be in this. Give me one second. Okay, great. Can you guys confirm that you can see my presentation? Well, the, the PDF. Can you see it? Because it doesn't appear, man. Zoom is weird here. Okay, so we got in here a short conversation, right? And it says conversation. She's very tall. She's very tall, right? So that's the conversation about. So here in this conversation, it's between Emily and Randy, okay? So what are we going to do in this short conversation, guys? This is just about descriptions as well. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to read the conversation two times, slow for you, okay? So you with the, your microphone off, Follow me up on the conversation just to practice a little bit the pronunciation of each word in there. And then, guys, we're going to practice, right, this short conversation among us, okay? So let's start with this. It says, Emily, I hear, listen, I hear you have a new girlfriend. You have a new girlfriend, Randy. Randy says, Jess, right, Jess. Her name's, listen, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous, and she's gorgeous, okay? So Emily says, really? Really? What does she look like? What does she look like? Right? Randy says, well, she's very tall. Well, she's very tall. Emily says, how tall? How tall? Okay. So Randy says, about six feet. About six feet, right? Two, one, I mean, two, one, yeah, suppose, suppose, right? Emily says, wow, that's, that is tall. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? What color is her hair? Esos ambos tienen la misma pronunciación, ¿ok? Her, her. Randy says, She has beautiful red hair. She has beautiful red hair. Emily says, And how old is she? And how old is she? Okay. Randy says, I don't know. I don't know. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. Medio raro, right? Siendo la novia y no sabe cuántos años tiene. Okay. But anyways. Okay, guys. From this vocabulary here. Do you have any question with any uh, word from here that you probably don't understand? Or oh, everything is okay? Is everything okay in that conversation, guys? Mm. Gorgeous teacher. Gorgeous. Gorgeous means Gorgeous. Bonita, bonita, adorable. Right? That's gorgeous. 
Ya. Yeah. Ok. So, I guess, guys. Ajá. Este. I suppose. ¿Cómo se dice? I suppose. I suppose es como, ah, yo creo o supongo. Right. I suppose. Right. Ok. Great, guys. Ok. Listen. What are we going to do? So, it's 7.22. Les voy a dar cinco minutos para que practiquen esta conversación. Pero necesito saber, people, quiénes son los que están como oyentes y quiénes pueden participar. Right? ¿Podrían poner el símbolo de una manito los que pueden participar, por favor, para enviarlos al breakout room y así no enviar con alguien que no esté? Right. Uh, participate, please. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, great, great. Because I'm about to create a breakout room. So I'm going to send you guys to work. I'm going to send you manually. Let me see. Okay, so just give me one second. I'm going to check on here. Sonia. All right, guys, just give me a second. I'm just like creating. Mm -hmm. The breakout rooms. Lisella, just not participating. But Karen, it's okay. All right, guys, let's open up the breakout rooms. I will give you five minutes. Then we're gonna come back in here, okay? I want you to practice that conversation. Let's go. Unámonos, por favor. Let's join in there. Guillermo and Jaime, do you have issues, guys, to get connected? Clara? Are you there, Clara? All right, guys, para los que están de oyente, los voy a enviar a los breakout rooms, nada más para que escuchen la conversación o la práctica que van a tener sus compañeros, ¿ok? So just give me a second.
about about six feet to one suppose. Wow, that is tall. That color is her hair. She has beautiful red hair. <laughs> Mm, how old is she? I don't know. She will tell me. She shirt. Ah, yes. I was in mute. La, la palabra de Randy, la última, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Dice Georges. Uh, gorgeous. 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 gorgeous, gorgeous. Gorgeous? Yes. Okay. Gorgeous. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> gorgeous. <laughs> uh, I hear you had a new girl girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley. And she's Gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet to one supposed. Wow, that is tall. What color is her here? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. Voy a empezar si usted. Hey, somos cuatro. ¿Quién es el otro? Eh, no, solo es Dennis, pero Dennis está como oyente, ok? So... Ustedes practican. Ya. Uh, yeah. uh, ok. Ok. I heard you had a new girlfriend, Brandy. Yes. Her name is Ashley. And she's Georgius. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Whoa, that's, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. Um, how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. Ahora empiezo yo. Sí. I heard you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Her name is Ash. Hello. Hola. Practic ¿Han practicado? Sí, ahorita. I hear you had a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley. Is she gorgeous? Esa, 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 esa palabra la encuentro complicada. Listen, gorgeous. Gor gorgeous. Go gorgeous. Exactly. <laughs> es otro sinónimo de para decir linda, bonita. Right? Mm -hmm. Que digamos que es pretty o pretty, sí. Sí, es como pretty. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Really, what does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? Above six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. <laughs> I, I just <laughs> you man having a girlfriend and you don't know her age 
como que Clara le diga a usted, David, sí, voy a ser tu novia, y, pero no te digo la edad porque no, no, porque no. <risa> I will be crazy, man. Ok, solo nomás reviso otros par de grupitos más y luego volvemos a la sala principal, ok? I want to hear you there, guys. All right. Ok, mister. Okay. So, what color is her hair? She has a she has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Hey, Mr. Teacher. Yes. I got one question. Uh, and the last one sent that is uh, that when Randy is is the last one, it says she won't tell me. Why it says she won't tell me? She won't tell me, it's like referring to the age, like she will not tell me. Como no me dirá. Uh, I understand, I completely understood that, but I, I thought it was going to be like in the past. Uh, no, won't is the negative uh, form the, uh, of will not. That's the contracted form of will not. You said it as won't. Yeah, I see it's, uh, it's like, in my case, I think it's like, it's a little weird because <laughs> uh, looking for the reading, Emily says before him, and how old is she? And after Emily is asking, like, he already know about her age or something like that. But then Randy says, I don't know, she won't tell me. I thought it was, it was, it was going to be like, in the past, it, like, she, she didn't tell me. I was about, it's just a question. Exactly. I was thinking actually the same because I mean, just imagine, yeah. just imagine if you have a girlfriend, how wouldn't you know your, uh, I mean, your girlfriend's age? I mean, she has to tell you. <laughs> yeah. That, that's But crazy. It's okay. that part. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's okay. Good. Thank you so much. All right. I'm going to check on another uh, couple of uh, purse and then we're going to go back to the main section. Okay. Okay. All right. What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How oh, tall? About six feet. Two, one, suppose. Wow. That is tall. What color is her? Uh huh. Hi, teacher. Hi. Uh, did you guys finish participating? Ya terminó. Okay, perfect. I think it's enough. So I want to hear you, but in the main section, okay? Creo que es tiempo de volver. Allá los voy a escuchar, okay? Bueno, okay. All right, perfect. See you there. All right, so everybody's just coming back. Hey, Christian, are you home already? That's good, brother. I'm gonna find a person for you to practice the conversation. Yes, I already cheat, teacher. <laughs> okay, perfect. That's good. That's good. All right, guys, so, so I'm gonna share uh, the conversation. And uh, we're going to start over with that. So just give me a second. I'm going to move a couple of, of people here. Okay, great. Clara Marina, so tell me who were you working with and uh, you're going to be the first one. Yeah. I hear you had a new girlfriend, Randy. <clears throat> who, who were you working with, Clara? Because uh, uh, I don't see the person. Hi, teacher. I am, and it's with you, right, David? Okay. Yes. Okay. Let's start over again, Clara. 
I I hear you had a new good friend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley, and she is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Gorgeous. Very good. Gorgeous. Uh, really, what does she look like? Well, she is very tall. How tall? About six feet to one supon. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good. Thank you, Clara and David. You did it excellent. All right. Now, Walter, who were you working with, mister? I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Oh, her, oh. her name is Ashley. And she's gorgeous. Really? What well, does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet. Two, one, suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, I don't know. She won't tell me. Very good. Thank you, Judy and Walter. Now, uh, let me see. Jocelyn. Let's go, you and your classmate. Who are you working with? ¿Con quién estaba trabajando usted? Because I don't remember. Roberto Guzmán, creo que Okay, very good. So, Roberto, let's go, Mr. You and Emily. Okay, okay. I mean, uh, Jocelyn. <laughs> Jocelyn, you can start. Okay. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Her name Ashley. He, she is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Really? Really? What does she look like? Well, she, she is very tall. How tall? About, about six feet, two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good. Thank you to you both guys. You did it excellent. Now, let me see who's next. Uh, 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 Jenny. Yes. Okay, you mm -hmm. and the person that you were working with, because I don't know, uh, who was the person you were working with? I no remember. <laughs> you don't remember the person? Me no, no vi su nombre, pero solo practicamos. Okay, who was working with Jenny? Yo. Ah, Karen. Okay, Karen. Let's go. <laughs> I hear you have a new girlfriend, Grandy. Yes, her name is Ashley, and she's your good. Really? Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two. A one super. Whoa. What is tall? What color is her hair? Her? She has beautiful red, red hair. And how old is she? I don't call, she won't tell me. All right, I don't know, she won't tell me. Okay, there you go, Karen, thank you. And thank you to you, Jenny, also. Great job, and uh, let's move. David Alberto, who were you practicing with? Yes, con Roberto, parece que se llama. Okay, there you go. 
I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good, guys. Thank you. You did it excellent. Now, let's move on here. Um, Alfredo Enrique, who were you practicing with? Alfredo, you there? Yes, yes. All right. Who were you uh, working with? Eh, Ana, creo que es Ana Recino. No sé. María. Ana María. Okay. There you go. Let's go. Okay. Emily sería Ana, ¿verdad? Okay. All right. Empiece. Okay. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley. And she gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About 60 feet to one supposy. Whoa, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good. I don't know. She won't tell me. There you go. Thank you, Alfredo and Ana Maria. Good job, guys. Yeah. Let me see who's next. Who hasn't participated, guys? ¿Quién más me falta? Sonia? You haven't participated, right? Okay. Uh, okay, very good. Let's go. Okay. I hear you had a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old, how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good. Thank you, girls. You did it excellent. Now let's move. Selena, who are you working with, Selena? I'm um, here, did you? Okay, great. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you how I need girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow. That is so. What what color is her hair? Her she hair. Has beautiful red hair. And how or is she? I don't know. She is won't tell me. She won't tell me. All right, there you go. Thank you. Excellent. All right. Let me see David Armando. Who are you working with, mister? Hello, teacher. Hi. ¿Con quién trabaja usted? Con Clara Marina. I am, you were with Clara, right? Okay. No, the, the fittest group. 
<laughs> exactly. It's because you got the camera off. That's the reason why I, I didn't remember. Okay, guys, is there any group that uh, am I missing? Ya participaron todos. Hay alguno que se me esté quedando. Ta, 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 Christian. Okay, yeah, Christian. I'm gonna <laughs> look for a person with you. And I think I found the person. Let me see. Where is the person? I don't participate, teacher. So... Yes, Jaime. Usted lo estaba buscando. Yeah, man. You, mister, are gonna participate with Christian. Falta Christian ahí también. Okay, so Christian, you can start and Jaime will follow you up, okay? Okay. I hear, I hear, I hear. I hear. You have a new, I hear. You have a new girlfriend, Cardi? Yes, her name, names are Ashley and she's gorgeous. Gorgeous? Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, very good. Thank you to you both guys. You did it excellent. Now guys, we're gonna focus on the grammar part from that conversation, right? Now in here, we got a couple of questions. Look, in this section, we're going to be discussing how to create questions depending on classification of appearance. For example, we got questions in here about general appearance, about age, about height, and about hair. So if you guys see, we have different structure questions for every classification, okay? So it's not the same structure for each uh, classification, just to put it this way. For example, if you're if we are going to ask about general appearance or physical appearance. So we got the structure question as, what does he or she or you look like? In this situation, guys, like no es un verbo. Like acá no significa gustar, okay? Sino que acá like es una preposición que se puede traducir como. Esa es la traducción, como. Ok? So, if you ask this question, what does she look like? It's like, como es ella, físicamente hablando. All right? Physically speaking, what does she look like? Right? Y usamos does, recuerden, porque estamos hablando de una tercera persona. Right? So, we're talking about a third person. Let's remember that, okay? What does she look like? Ah, if you see here, in the answer, you can describe the person, how the person is physically speaking, okay? For example, you said she's tall, right? With red hair, right? Con cabello rojo. She's gorgeous, right? So you can say, uh, she's pretty, right? Whatever you're like can describe this person uh, with the adjective that you want, right? But in here, mostly it's just about physical appearance, okay? Now, can you ask a yes, no question? Yes, for example, does he wear glasses? Does he wear glasses? It's like, ah, usa el lentes, right? So, if you look at the answer, it says, yes, and he has a beard. Yes, and he has a beard, right? So in there, guys, you're talking about something that we can see, right? Physically speaking, right? That's like the way how, guys, we ask about 
physical traits, right? Physical characteristics that you can see on a person. Let's remember. But if you are going to ask about this person's age, that's different, the structure, because with the age, you use the verb to be. Remember, with the age, you use the verb to be. And the most common question is, how old is she? Right? It's like in the normal question. Hey, how old are you? Right? That's like the normal question. How old is she? Okay, so in the answer here you got, she's about 32. Colocamos about, guys, cuando no estamos seguros de la edad de la persona. Okay? For example, si yo les digo, hey people, how old is Jocelyn? How old is Jocelyn? All right. ¿Cómo me dirían ustedes si me van a dar una respuesta a esa pregunta? How old is Jocelyn? ¿Qué me dirían ustedes? Yo. No sé. Okay. Yes. Ajá. All right. Check this out. Is very free about. Okay. All right. So check this out. How old is, all right, just, just a little, all right? So, if you're not sure, si ustedes no saben, okay, pero quieren dar un aproximado, right? Ustedes pueden decir, she is about. Y aquí colocan la cantidad. ¿Cuántos creen que tiene? Like 40. <laughs> ah, man, I, was, I got a doubt, mister. Let me tell you first. <laughs> okay. it's about it's a, hey, let me uh -huh. tell you. Uh, can I say, can I say she is about her 40s? Like, for example. Yes, yes. Uh, in there, es cuando mencionamos una década, right? Una cantidad de años que nosotros creemos que ella puede estar, right? That's in a decade. Yeah, she's about, oh, aquí. She is in her 40s, like that. She's in her 40s. Es como, ah, está en sus 40s, de 40 a 49, right? In that age. Uh, okay, but I was saying that in a different way. She is about her 40s. Mm, no. You gotta Can say, say in, like that or it doesn't work like that? In her 40s is better. It's more common. It's better. It's the right way, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's Thank the correct so way. All right, very good. So in here you can say she is about about what twenty three maybe, all right. So you can use it like this, right? She is about twenty three. That's a, like an approximate, right? So Jocelyn, are we close on this age? Is more or less? Less. Less? Really? All right, so we must say uh, she's about 20. Okay, great. So, but if you guys see, about is like when you're giving an approximate of age, okay? Let's remember that. All right. Or oh, you can say, ah, uh, she's in her, let's see, 30s. She's in her 30s. What happening here? Es cuando... Tiene 30, pero no sabemos si es 31, 35, 39, whatever, right? So it's like just about there, right? Or you can even say in your 20s, right? So I can say David is in his 20s. So I'm just saying that David probably is 20 or 29, but in that approximate of years, okay? That's what it is. And then we got how old is he, right? That's referring to... 35. Uh, what did you say, Alfredo? ¿Qué dijo Alfredo? David is 35. Ah, okay. So you see? <laughs> Got more, man. Okay, there you go. So check that out. The answer, he is in his 20s. Okay, so you see? That's like giving an approximate, right? Ya damos un aproximado ahí. There you go. Now... 
when we talk about height, that's different, right? So check this out. How tall is she? ¿Qué tan alto es? ¿Qué tan alta es ella? Right? How tall is she? Right? So you see, this is like the way how you guys ask about the height of a person, right? Okay, so you say, I mean, how tall is Clara? Ah, Clara is, right? You might say, or oh, she is, or oh, she is, one meter and what? 60 centimeters? <laughs> Something like that. All right, so that's like an approximate. So you see, so you can give it like that, right? She is one meter 88, or oh, she is one meter uh, 50. One meter 44 or whatever, right? Right? In the United States, it's like super common to use feet. I always have feet, no uh, meters as we use it in here, right? Allá en Estados Unidos se usa más el feet, right? En las inches, no los metros. So that's like a, a very different uh, uh, way, right? So, but this is like a different way, right? She's six feet, two. So you see? That's like a little bit different, right? Okay, but that's like another way how you can ask about how tall is a person, right? And then we got, how tall is he? Recuerden que podemos sustituir he y poner, por ejemplo, a how tall is Walter, for example, right? How tall is Walter? And you can say, ah, he's quite short. Ah, es un poco bajito, right? He's quite short. So you can give an answer like that, right? When you're not sure about how tall that person is. What about the hair, right? With the hair, it's just like a little bit different. So with the hair, guys, you can ask, for example, how long is her hair, right? What is how long, guys? How long is her hair? ¿Qué creen que quiere decir eso? Cuán largo. Right. Cuán largo del cabello. Exactly, right? Cuán largo del cabello. Yes, qué tan largo es su cabello, right? And it says it's medium length, right? It's medium length, right? So you can answer like that. Podemos decir how short is her hair, right? Ah, qué tan corto, right? How short? Depending on what you are asking about, right? And then you can ask, what color is his hair, right? Ah, what is, what color is his hair? What am it's I talking about? Uh, red. No, right? Mm -hmm. You can say like that, right? De qué color es su cabello, right? Ah, it's dark, light brown, or he has brown hair. So you got two ways of answer, right, to that question, right? There you go. Okay. Recuerden, usamos it acá porque nos referimos a algo que no se refiere a una persona, sino parte del cuerpo, right? Usamos it en este caso. That's the reason why, okay? Because we are referring to the hair. When it comes to a person, you can say he or she, right? Depending on the situation. Okay, great. I don't know, guys, if you have any question related to this. Any doubt? Everything is okay. Thank you so much. Okay, very good. There you go. By Monday, guys, we're going to do this activity. Para el lunes vamos a hacer esta actividad que tenemos acá. Vamos a dar un pequeño repaso con relación a, la, a eso que hemos estado viendo. And we're going to be working on here, guys, on this couple of questions that we got here, right? So we're going to provide a short review about what we have been discussing. And we're going to be focusing on here, okay? There you go, guys. Okay. So I think that's going to be everything for tonight. Thank you for getting connected, guys. And I hope you have a wonderful weekend. And let's see you on Monday, okay? Thank you for connecting, guys. Bye-bye. See you. All right. Good night.
See you guys. Good night. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, good night guys. Bye bye. See you on Monday. Good night. Bye, teacher. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye.